Earlier, you saw the G diapers, a cross between a disposable and a cloth diaper. Supposedly better for the environment, but not quite as nasty as full-fledged cloth diapers. Fox 13's Kirk Youngke took a G diaper to an experienced diaper changer. As we ask the question, Kirk, does it work? All right, so we know the drill with the G diaper, a reusable shell and a disposable liner, but it has to pass the mom test before we decide if the G diaper works. The G diaper video on the web is impressive. Its liner decomposes within a month. Other diapers take millenniums. At the Salt Lake Valley Waste Management Facility, workers are burying trash every single day. And you can bet there are plenty of diapers here. When you think about how many children are born here, you know, and just in the city, in the county, uh, you can imagine how much garbage is produced, uh, you know, disposable diapers are produced. The G Diaper Company is trying to change that. They claim their product is more earth friendly. You can flush it, compost the wet ones, or throw away any of them in the trash. Experts say anything that creates less trash for babies is a huge help for them. Newborns and uh, children wearing diapers uh, produce the most, you know, amount of weight per 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 ton oh, wow. per year. But will it pass the mom test? We took it to first time mom Mindy Bingham. Little Ryler is just three months old. She's currently using plastic disposable diapers. It's really easy because when I'm done using it, I can fold it up and put it in a bag or, you know, throw it in the garbage. Her first impression of the G diapers were the instructions. I was confused. I had to have my husband help me understand how to use the diaper. You shouldn't have to know to read instructions to use the diaper. She said everything felt like a process from putting the diaper together. Snap it in. To getting rid of the dirty diaper. You have to whip down the sides, put in the middle of the, the middle of the diaper into the toilet, and then hold it so that it doesn't clog your toilet, and then it still clogged my toilet. You have to pour the inside into the toilet. You use your swirl stick and swirl it around. Then you flush and... Hold it so that it doesn't clog your toilet, and then it still clogged my toilet. Bingham was not impressed with the G diaper. I do like that it helps the environment. I think cloth diapers would be more convenient rather than this. She says she loved the fabric and liked the fit, but in the end, it was just inconvenient. She says maybe other moms would have better luck. It could work. <laughs> it didn't work for you. It didn't work for me. Now, I do want to point out that even the company's website says you may have an icky encounter at first until you get the hang of these things. A starter kit with two shells and ten liners sells for $27. They could make you more eco-friendly, but are they more trouble than it's worth? Check out the company's website for more info, including stores here in Utah that sell the G diaper. It's on my blog at myfoxutah.com. In the studio, Kirk Yonke, Fox 13 News, Utah.